Getting your website on the internet is like owning your own piece of cyber real estate. So let's say that you've got your server, your content, and your website all online and tweaked to perfection. So all you need to do now is keep it that way. So here are some tips and tools to keep your website up and running. Whether you have a hosting provider or you host your own website, the main thing that you want to keep track of is if your site ever goes down or if it goes offline. A good basic free service can be found here, and on this website you can monitor your site's uptime and traffic. It checks every 15 minutes and then gives you a 48 hour report. If you host your own website, then you want a lot more detailed information about your site, such as your server and your bandwidth information. Luckily there's a program that monitors the complete state of your website and the server that it's running off of. You can find it here. Just click on the download link to download the free trial and after you sign up they'll send you an email that takes you to this website. This is the command center where you can monitor your website and your server. In order to monitor it you'll need to download the remote agent onto your server so go to agent download agent. Once you have it downloaded onto your server, run through the installation process and then it will ask you for your login information which should have been emailed to you. Then you can set up everything that you want it to monitor. In the 24x7 checks you can configure it to monitor your drive space and performance and to add a new check just click on the add button and it will give you parameter options to choose from. For example I'm going to set it to monitor the memory usage and then I'll click OK. You can also check your website's uptime, just click add to enter in the new website and check your Windows services, bandwidth and file sizes. You can also configure it to check things daily such as virus alerts, backups, drive space, hackers and disk errors. When you're through you can run a report to see how all your checks do. Then set it to start monitoring so now you can access it through the remote management dashboard link that you received in your email and view your website statistics. If there's any problems this program also allows you to remote into the desktop to make any changes. Aside from website and server uptime tracking, another major thing that you want to keep an eye on is viruses. You can check to see if your website has a virus by going to this website and entering in your URL. When you click scan it should analyze your site and see if there are any threats. If there are any threats you can use security to scan and monitor your website's integrity. Just click on scanner and enter in your URL to scan it. The resulting page will tell you if your website has any security threats and will show you what you need to do to fix them. Then if you click on web monitoring you can sign up to have it tell you if someone tries to hack into your site. These are just a few of the tools that I found so if you know of any more feel free to post them in the comments below. Be sure to check out Tinkernut.com on Facebook and Twitter. Alright that's it for this tutorial. For more go to Tinkernut.com.